Halloween decorations downriver are disappearing, and it's not the bad plot of a horror movie. Tim Pamplin takes the night cam to Lincoln Park to investigate. All across our region, the Halloween decorations are going up. The kids are loving it. Free candy season. But there's two grown-ups running around, taking all the fun away. Thieves and lowlifes. They must be some type of scum. Strong words from two residents I caught up with after this man and woman have been running around the neighborhoods stealing these inflatables. Oh, they're not cheap. Oh, no, they're um, about 100 bucks. The thing was about $200, man. These residents say it's not about the money, it's about the principle. You really shouldn't just be going around stealing people's property. Taken in the last couple of nights, this rather fancy pumpkin with a witch's hat, this motorcycle, and a minion with his glasses. Hang on, wait a second. Go back to that tape. The man, he's got no hair, he's got glasses. Hmm, he's attacking the pumpkin there. His lady friend, she said to be heavy set, blonde or brown hair, and an awful lot of it. They strike in the middle of the night. There you see a car driving by. They didn't flinch. Maybe they're trying to make their kids happy. Who knows? You know, blow them up in their yard and act like they went and got them. So these residents say they're keeping an eye out, asking you to do the same. And if you two are watching tonight, Parker says he'd really like his motorcycle back. My favorite thing, motorcycle. That was his favorite thing in Lincoln Park, Tim Pamplin, Local 4.